I don't have to tell you things are bad. Everybody knows things are bad. It's a depression. People out of work or scared of losing their jobs. The dollar by the nickels worth. Banks are going bust. Shopkeepers keep a gun under the counters. Punks are running wild in the streets and there seems to be nobody nowhere that knows what to do with this. Now, let's get into it. We know the air is unfit to breathe. We know our food is unfit to eat, but yet we sit in our living rooms as we watch our televisions as some local newscaster tells us that there's been 15 homicides and 63 violent crimes as if that's the way it's supposed to be. We know things are bad. They're worse than bad. They're crazy. It's like everybody everywhere is going crazy. And we don't go out anymore. What do we do? We sit in a house as the world around us becomes smaller and smaller. And all we can say is, please, at least leave us alone in our living rooms with our TVs and our toasters and our still belted radials and we won't say anything. Well, I'm not gonna leave you alone! I want you to get mad. I don't want you to riot. I don't want you to protest. I don't want you to write to your local congressman because I would know to tell you to write. I don't have the answers to the inflation or the unemployment or the punks running wild in the streets. All I know is that you have got to get mad. You've got to stand up and say, God damn it, I'm a human being and my life has value. Now I want everybody to get out of your chairs. Get out of your chairs and find a window and I want you to open it. And I want you to scream out, I am mad as hell and I can't take this anymore. Scream out that window, I am mad as hell and I can't take